Hi everybody, uh, my name is Motwana. You can call me Motwana Obant. Uh, my other name is uh, Motwana Mkosi. So let's get started without further ado. So we have a question right here. See, we have a question right here. So let me just move it to the other side, to the left. But you know, like I said, I always send shout out to uh, the student who sent the question because just to give to honor them, you know, because it's them who sent me the question. See, so uh the fish th this shot go to Mputi Lindo Kutle. Man, she sent me a lot of questions. Come on, Putty man. <laughs> You've been sending a lot of message, you know. So she said, Hey Mutwana, you know, thank you so much, you know, for your help. It's helping us. We love it, man. Oh man, yeah, uh, no problem. You know, we did a lot of chat me, me and Putin Lindo Kutle. A lot of them you can see here, 10 messages, you know. So I was like, okay, cool, I'm happy to assist you. And uh, just let me know I'm gonna apply to I'm gonna upload tonight. Uh, no, I'm still busy with the same. So me and her was like back and forth. So now let's get back to the business. See, so now this here, solve this question. So this is simultaneously question. So what you do whenever this type of question, try to make two variable equal. Look this 0 0.25, this is 2.5. So try to make them equal. So how are you gonna make them equal? How are you gonna make this? This look like that or either way around. Me personal, what I'm going to do, I can just simply multiply this by 10. Because if I multiply the top one by 10, and there's going to be 2.5. See? So, let's see. So, so to look alike. Okay? That's your attention. You see? That's a trick. So, I'm going to say, okay, multiply by 10. Let's come here and see if it's true. So, I'm going to cancel that one clear. Well, that was the previous question. So, 10, 10 multiply just by mm, oh, 0 0.25 0 0.25 oh 0 0.25 my god I forgot 0 0.25 sorry that's gonna give us 2.5 but you must multiply for all of them for all the lines so what we're gonna say now it's gonna finish so I'm gonna say uh when I multiply the face one is gonna give me uh multiply the face one is gonna give me 2.5 now but this has a y equal 10 times 1.5 is going to give us 15 but this one has x and then you multiply for each one for this for the second one for the last one which is going to give us 30. so the second one you don't have to do anything because that's what you wanted these to be the same either this and this to be the same or that and that but we pick y to be the same that's always dealing with the y but when you multiply it's going to affect everything so the second one is going to be 2.5 y equal to 5.5x and then plus or plus 1.5 so what we're going to do here eliminate because you pick them to be the same so you can eliminate we're going to put y minus you know why we're going to put minus here because if minus 2.5 look 2.5 minus 2.5 is going to give us zero equal now you go for the second one 15 minus 5.5 and this is going to give us 9.5x we go for the last one for the last one is going to be what positive 30 minus positive 1.5 which is going to give us positive 2080.5 if i'm not mistaken so what we're going to do we're going to take one over because we want to get the value of x so let's take this one over or we can take this one over so it's going to become negative 9.5 x equal equal in between them and this going to be 28.9 so I can divide by negative 9.5 to get the value of x, negative 9.5. This and this cancel. And there we have it. X equal to 28.5 divided by negative 9.5. Okay. So take 28.5 or cancel there. And then go to the fraction. 28.5 divide by... Uh, negative 9.5 so negative 9.5 is that correct 9.5 it should be so this is going to give us negative 3 okay so the value of x equal to negative 3 so x we already know equal to negative 3 so i'm going to say okay my x equal to negative 3 equal to negative 3 so my x equal to negative 3 so you want to get y if you want to get y, then it's easy. What you can do, you can just finalize. So before we get, uh, okay, 
number two before you get white family right you might be new here to this program okay please come here and subscribe okay just come there and subscribe okay now let's go and get y so to get y is easy what you can do see this value of x plug in here look anyone either the first one or the second one in the position of x and then get y me i'll prefer the second one but you can pick the first one it doesn't matter so our x equal to negative three so i'm going to plug in this question here we don't need this anymore. okay okay so then i'm going to say 2.5 y equal to 5.5 what is our x negative 3 plus 1.5 so we want to get the value y how are you going to get the value y i can divide by 2.5 and i can divide by 2.5 this is this cancer so y equal to so i can simply plug in a calculator plug in a calculator get a final answer okay so we're going to say fraction fraction and they say 5.5, 5.5, bracket, negative 3, bracket, negative 3, and they close bracket, and they come plus, plus, 1.5, 1.5, and then you over, you over 2.5, 2.5. And I think it's going to give them negative 6. Okay, negative 6. So now we know exactly how value of y equal to negative 6. Okay, so value of y, y equal to negative six so which is going to be okay this is x and this is y so this is going to be option one x equal to three and y equal to negative negative six and x equal to negative three so option one so look uh little cool and put little cool uh from how um in a lot of students from kuzum tau in uh uh ran clary Man, thanks a lot for the question. This question, like I say, no nobody should feel ashamed ask me the question. Just be free, you know. Like I say, I like to save a lot of people, not like individualistic. A lot of people, when I say, it makes me happy because about giving back to the community, give people knowledge so they can learn and go share this video to a lot of people. And you know, if you have not paid time or you have not yet subscribed, leave a comments because if you leave the comments, then I'm gonna send shout out to you. See what I'm saying? So thanks a lot for your time, and I'll see you soon.